Now let's see how to make the refresher page through a redirect to the same page. And we will do this in various programming languages that PHP, ASP, jQuery, JavaScript and HTML. Obviously this last is not a language of real programming. All this is based in the redefine the server rule 301 move permanently in various programming languages. Refresh with JavaScript. With the client language par excellence all this is done in your browser with this simple instruction. Or with. Which for practical purposes produces the same effect. Or as you want to always using JavaScript we can do a refresh time with the set timeout function as follows. Refreshing a page with jQuery. Let's see how to refresh with jQuery say the closest to the JavaScript language, given that it is a derivation. In this case the syntax is. Which as you can see, is almost refresh identical in HTML incidents. page. Let's see now how to refresh an HTML page. To do this, we will use the meter refresh tag. Obviously we will put the header HTML. The syntax for the refresh of a page with HTML is as follows. Let's see now how to refresh the server side languages. Refresh a page asp. To make the refresh with aspnid we must use the redirect Refreshing rule as page with PHP technology. And last, but not least, let's see how to redirect to the server side technology. In this case we will use the header function and the syntaxes. These mentioned are of course only the main ways, then there are many more, to get the same results. Wandering around the web, if they really are of each. I recommend these, because they are the traditional methods, that do not create conflicts.